big blaze started in the back in the repair room of Noble Shoe Store. And the problem is now the fire was so hot and destroyed so much of this longtime building that they can't get in to fully determine what started it. The big blaze started just around five o'clock here at Noble Shoe Store, a store that's been here for 29 years. Eight people inside, including the owner's son, who tried to put out the blaze but was unsuccessful. He got burned on his legs. The store completely destroyed. The people inside lucky to be alive. Investigators still trying to determine exactly what caused this fire. At this point, they're running into some snags. We haven't even gotten a chance to start the investigation. We've only isolated the scene. Because of the damage that occurred, there's a great deal of structural instability. We haven't been able to go in. We had our technical rescue team from the county come in to assess the situation, uh, see if they could shore it up, and can't even do that. So right now our plan is do uh, partial demolition uh, so that we can remove those uh, unstable structural members and then begin our investigation, try to figure out what happened. Several agencies investigating, but the state fire marshal taking the lead on this one. An entire lifetime's work destroyed right here on a landmark on Colorado Ave, but the owner says they're lucky to be alive and they will be back. In Stewart, Terry Parker, WPBF 25 News.